everybody, it's Mike from Chili Pepper Madness. Today we are making a big pot of white bean chicken chili. Uh, white bean chicken chili is a super easy recipe to make. It's great for a weeknight meal. Uh, just throw everything into a pot and let it simmer. Uh, it's easy to customize and you can make it as spicy as you want to. Uh, but either way, it's always big on flavor and it's one of my favorites. So uh, let me show you how to make it. All right, white bean chicken chili coming right up for you. First thing we do is get my pan nice and hot, my uh, a good sized pot here, and add a bit of olive oil. And I have about a pound and a half of chicken. Um, I'm using some chopped chicken breast and chicken thighs. I like, it, I like the mixture, but you can really use just chicken breast or chicken thighs if you want to. Use your favorite. And I have a, a medium sized white onion chopped. And I have a mixture of chili peppers here. So for these, this recipe for these peppers that I'm using, uh, I have some jalapeno. I have a, a spicy pepper that I grew in my garden and also some poblano peppers. And you can use roasted poblanos, which is great here, but uh, I'm just gonna use the fresh chopped poblanos. And uh, you can really vary up the types of peppers that you're using um, based on how spicy you want your recipe to be. Um, you know, you want to be crazy hot, go for some habanero or ghost peppers, or uh, hey, you want some reaper? <laughs> I know you guys are crazy sometimes. So, all right, cook this down for about five minutes or so to soften up the vegetables and get the chicken a bit browned. And then uh, we will continue to make some chili. All right, the chicken is browning up nicely. Everything's cooking down, it's starting to smell good in here. So moving forward, next we add some fresh chopped garlic. And uh, I always like to use a lot of garlic, as I like to say. Uh, you can use as much as you want. I have uh, about four cloves, I believe, just all chopped up. And uh, you only need to cook it down for about 30 seconds or so until you can smell that gorgeous garlic bloom. <laughs> Love it, delicious. All right, so next up here is I've got my white beans. And I'm using great northern beans here, but you can really use any, any type of white bean, use your favorite. And you can use other beans as well, but this is white bean chicken chili, so. All right, get that stirred. And I have a couple of cups here of uh, chicken broth. Just get that popped in. And you can use uh, vegetable if you want to, or other broths, but chicken, chicken's got good flavor. Get this nicely stirred. And now comes the seasoning. So with the seasonings, you can really change up uh, the types and the amounts of seasonings that you do. But this is a blend that I personally prefer. So uh, for this recipe, I have uh, about a tablespoon each here. I've got a tablespoon of cumin, pop that in. And I have a tablespoon of American chili powder blend, chili powder blend, you can use your favorite. I like to make a little homemade blend. And I have a tablespoon of ancho powder. I just love ancho powder, it's uh, outstanding. So good here. And I have a tablespoon of dried oregano. Get that in, set these aside. And do not forget, Salt and pepper to taste. A little bit of salt, a little pepper. Mmm, I love pepper. And lastly, uh, hot sauce to taste. You can, uh, you can skip the hot sauce if you want to keep it milder. Um, add a lot, of course, for extra spicy. Get popped in. A little more. Sorry, Patty. Okay, stir it up. Look at this, look at the color on that. White bean chicken chili, outstanding. It's gonna be a great dinner tonight. All right, so here we go, guys. We're just gonna let this simmer for a little while and uh, let all the flavors blend and bloom. It's gonna to work together, become a delicious pot of white bean chicken chili. So I will return when it's just about done. All right, got a really nice simmer in here and it's uh, smelling delicious. Mm. So I'm gonna go ahead and give it a taste here. It's been simmering for a little over 20 minutes at this point. Mm. Oh yes, excellent flavor. So at this point what you can do, you can adjust your seasonings if you want to, a little more salt, a little more pepper, a little more hot sauce, a little more chili powder, just really go with your personal tastes. Um, but what I wanna do is I wanna thicken this up just a little bit. So I've got a couple tablespoons here of cornmeal and I'm gonna stir that in here. And the cornmeal will help thicken up your chili a little bit. And it'll also add a little bit of extra flavor to it. You have that, that corn flavor. And uh, 
get that stirred in and all incorporated. And uh, we'll let it simmer for another 10 minutes to thicken up nicely. And then we will uh, come take a look. It's almost done. All right, boom, look at this. It has thickened up nicely. And uh, at this point, if you want, you can add a little bit more cornmeal if you want to. Let it simmer longer. You can let it simmer for uh, a good hour or more if you want. Uh, let those flavors develop even more. But uh, but this is good to go. That's it. Uh, it's super easy to make, isn't it? White bean chicken chili could be an easy weeknight meal. Uh, you know, pop it in for a, a quick weekend dinner. Even make it for lunch. It's uh, delicious. I, I just love chili. I love the spices. I love the flavor of this. And uh, I hope you guys like it too. And if you do make it, please let me know. Let me know how you like it. So uh, that's it. Mike from Chili Pepper Madness. I will see you next time. Thanks, bye.